all clear? Oh, uh, yep, yeah, it's good for me. Joe Brad interview, take two, marker. <laughs> My name is Joe Brad. I'm from the streets of New York. I love this city more than any place in the world. I grew up in Staten Island, in this neighborhood, in this house. Behind me is the location of the bar that my father was murdered in by John Gotti. Gabino, crime boss, John Gotti. That's when I had to make the decision. Do I want to be a bad guy and revenge my father's death, or do I want to help other people? And now I do what I love. I help people not become other people's victims. I was two years old when my father went to prison. I was eight years old when my father got out of prison. I was 11 when he was killed. And John Gotti made his mark in East New York after killing James McBratney. You know, Gotti didn't pull the trigger, but he did time in prison for being involved with the murder of my father. My life started to go to the dark side and it could have went further, but I decided to change my life and change my direction and help people who aren't able to help themselves. They have been drug dealers for as long as I've been living here. The police were here not too long ago and nothing happened. People come through with all types of problems. Drug problem. The mazepine, calamipine, carisperdol. Kids are in detox. That's a detox medication. They're snorting it. She's a harm to herself. You got behavior problems. No. Yeah, no, I, I don't want to be on camera. I don't want to be on camera. Stop, stop. People who want me to investigate cheating, what? stealing, you know, whatever problem comes, I solve it. Fill my heart with song. Being in a lot of situations, I have to have a diverse team. Oh, where's my fucking hat? Get it? Uh -huh. Right over there. Want me to sit up there No. Get the fuck out. I wish I was five for fucking four. I wish you were fucking six, seven. You! When are you gonna let me do some undercover shit? They never see me coming. Even Why? when you're just walking, you're undercover. You're four fucking feet tall. What are you kidding me? So what are you working on, Joe? You got an idea. How about I just become an elf during the fucking holidays? You know, Billy's hit a few bumps in the road. He had a hard time. He went to prison. And now he wants to make amends. Joe has a very imposing presence. And when he speaks to people, they listen. Yo, yo. Get out before I fucking kick your fucking ass. Who are you? Sometimes tasting a snow cone makes results come fast. I have a court right now uh, with my ex-boyfriend. He uh, had me. We'll get him to go to the diner with you. Well, why are you up? I'm gonna tell you what you have to say to him. Once you say them, he gets angry. We'll get him to say something that he incriminates himself. Okay. Did you get a booze? Uh -huh. My friend, she started using a lot of different substances. She's spending about 5,000 a month. Because you're hurting, you can't hurt other people. It doesn't make you right. Oh, 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 me. I have seen drugs tear families apart. If we don't act now, she will, she will die. I'm grateful, because now a couple years later, I have two years clean. I'm the witness clean. I am you get you clean. Yeah. Everybody needs somebody to help them. I don't know you. Don't you dare yell at me in my house. If you need help, reach out. You know, just couldn't control it. Get out of my house! Get out! You got a problem? Call Joe Bratton.